Oh my god, hi, I'm moving. I'm scared. Anyway, I just woke up. Uh, it's like half six. Also, I am running dangerously late. Like, me running dangerously late for a flight wouldn't be like me. I just wanted to quickly show you what I'm wearing, though, before I leave for the airport. I'm wearing this wee Ralph Lauren sweater vest. Okay, wait, I look really weird, but anyway. And then just some jeans. But, like, does that not look quite cool? I don't know. I'm just really trying to live my best Pinterest life. I've been really flat out on Pinterest recently. And I've seen a sweater vest. And it was a bit of a bold buy for me. Like, I'm very, like, if it's not sold in Topshop or Urban Outfitters, I'm not buying it. I pushed the boat out and I got it. And I actually really like it anyway shut up that's not important i'm literally moving i had about two hours sleep last night because i was like lying there and i was like i was about to be asleep then i'd be like placemats i need fucking placemats and then I'd be on the Ikea website looking at all the placemats. Uh, so that was really good. I'm absolutely exhausted. But anyway, I can't I can't keep talking to you. I can keep talking to you for days. But I need to go to the airport. Okay, we have about 20 minutes to get there. And it's about a good 30 minute drive, which is fantastic. Also, someone here forgot to check me in. <laughs> Not me. It was you. It's your flight. It's, well, you get yourself organized. You want to be independent. And as well, my bag's overweight. Thanks a lot, Mum. Right. Yes. <laughs> it also is my dad's birthday today and I've just got up and left, which is a bit grim for me, but like, shit happens, grim. If Starbucks isn't open here, I will just turn around and come back to Belfast. It's not happening. Like, I can't, I haven't eaten yet and like, I'm a, I'm a very, like, as soon as I wake up, I need to eat kind of person or else my day is just not going to go well. And I don't think anything's going to be open in the airport, which is actually really upsetting for me because I need a wee porridge or something. Do you know what I mean? I might start getting really into porridge now I live on my own. The thought of actually having to cook my own meals. Oh my god, Paul, how am I going to cook? I know, I don't know you're going to cook very well. Breakfast is fine and lunch is fine. But like dinner, I know I want to make two things. Like, will I just be having avocado and baked beans on toast for breakfast, lunch and dinner? every day potentially but that's not even bad because if you think about it it's actually really nutritious because you got the vegetables protein and carbs so you couldn't ask for much more really i'm running on literally two hours sleep i'm feeling a bit fragile oh my god am i crying also right look how gross the weather is and i'm loving life because you know in london it's like a different climate it's like 35 degrees and sunny there i suppose it's a lot more south than like belfast and um, on the map <laughs> Okay, I've arrived and I'm sweating so much. It's so warm here. It was 10 degrees in Belfast when I left this morning and it's like 25 here. I'm not used to this tropical climate. So we are like in the process of bringing all our bags up and like all my deliveries, like because I got all my furniture delivered here. This like we package was left at our door and it says it's from Crosstown Donuts, which I have seen, I think on Zoella's vlogs before. Okay, yes, I'm a Zoella stan. <gasps> Is that champagne? Why? Oh, oh my god. god! A gift oh. for you. Congrats on your face. Welcome to London. Love Lucy from Glam. <laughs> oh my god, stop. Oh. Okay, right, time for the apartment tour. I was gonna like wait until everything's put away, but basically I'm gonna put the general apartment tour in this video and then I'm gonna do a bit of a room transformation because at the minute my room kind of makes me feel a bit sick in my mouth, but it's fine. We're gonna do a big transformation, but that's a separate video. So I'm just gonna give you the flat tour now. This is the hallway and then here's, here's our door. These are all my clothes and literally there's so many packages. We just spent about three hours bringing up all the boxes. But this is my room. You can see the potential. It's pretty big. We've got these nice big wardrobes. Like I have got so much room. I was scared about being a bit like squished in here. But like there is so much room. But yeah, like you see you see the potential. Okay, just stick with me for the potential. Like I can see the river. Can you see? Then in here is my bathroom. It's so funny because I'll basically be like taking a shit. And then this is my view. So like I can just like say hey to the people in the offices. Guys, I'm a wee bit, I'm a wee bit obsessed. Here's my shower. How nice is that sink as well? Guys, I'm fangirling. I can't believe this is my fucking apartment. And Flossie's, of course. Flossie. This is Flossie's bathroom. She likes a bath. I don't like a bath because it does bring me back to the days of like violently scrubbing my tan off to the point I would bleed. But I'm I passed those days. I'm naturally sun kissed now, so. And then you walk in here, we've got loads of Ikea bags. Here's our living room. Our TV is gonna go there, but we haven't obviously got a TV yet. Kitchen, wee dining area. In here we've just got a washer dryer. That's pretty new tech for me. In my house we have two separate. I didn't even know a washer dryer was a thing. I was just looking at my bag like, and my mum packed me this this morning. I could cry my eyes out. It's a little photo album. And look at the first like three photos. Odie with sunglasses on. And then me and George. 
and then George. Oh my god, look at that. Is that not the look? I know he's the ugliest dog in the world, but like for the ugliest dog in the world, he's pretty cute there. Stop, I could cry. Oh my god, me it formal. It is just really upsetting. That's basically all I have for now. We're gonna go to IKEA because I need to get like blankets. I actually don't even have any like plates and stuff. So we're gonna go to like pop to IKEA, maybe a bit of home sense. I'm living my best Zoella vlog miss life. Maybe it's never been to a home sense. Do they have them in Ireland? No. Oh my god. I know we've got TK Maxx, but we haven't got Home Sense. I've been watching IKEA vlogs and Home Sense vlogs non-stop. Like I don't know what I've turned into. I'm a shell of my former self. We just got back from Sainsbury's. Now I've got another huge mess. I haven't eaten since breakfast. You know what I got uh, for breakfast? I got the Meze box from EasyJet. So I actually had crackers and red pepper. I got the Meze. I get. I get the Meze box every time I'm on the fucking plate. In I got uh, crackers and red pepper dip and hummus, and that is literally all I have in my stomach right now. I'm like, excuse me. What is that? I don't understand how people do moving vlogs. What the hell? Because like everyone seems so chill when they're moving and they're like, accepting You're joking. I can't handle this anymore. Every time we go to order something, they're like, Oh, sorry, we just closed. Yeah, I don't understand how people do moving vlogs. Like this has been the most stressful, tiring day ever. We thought we'd done like, I'd say, what, 60,000 steps. So then we checked Flossie's Fitbit and we'd done 9,000, which is actually less than the recommended. But anyway, this is currently what it looks like when you walk into your apartment. It's just such a mess. It's stressing me. I like to be clean. I say that and my, you all know that my room is so messy at home, but don't let on. How fun is it? Me and Flossie are both, uh, well, she's veggie, I'm vegan, so like there's no meat in the house. Mmm, <laughs> yummy. I feel like you're gonna hate it. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you eat it like that? Oh my god, Flossie, that was disgusting. It's not. It is disgusting. We need to try my chicken. We did do quite an exciting shot, mm. didn't we? We really did. We got lots of fruit and veg. I got a mug. Oh my God, we also got, where do you see? We got a kettle and we got a matching toaster, which is over there. And I'm just not gonna show you because like, do you care? No, and I wouldn't care. I don't care what your toaster looks like. So I, I Well, no, I, I don't. Right, listen, tell me your, your honest opinions on my voice. Hmm. Ready? Be honest. Actually try. <laughs> Baby, you're like lightning in a bottle. It was a, it was a movie. <laughs> squeaky, squeaky bean, I think. Chicken tikka chicken. It changes the game. It is actually real chicken. This with ketchup. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Wheat and pea protein. That's me. I'm pretty hench. You know there's a gym here, so we actually are gonna get pretty hench. Mm, but it's not open yet. Apparently mm. it's gonna open next week though. Yeah, and there's a pool, so I can go for a swim. I can't swim. Are we ever gonna get food? Baby, you're like, baby. Whoa, she's really good. <laughs> Sometimes I don't wanna be happy. I stand Dixie, yeah. but I'm obsessed with Charlie. I just love Charlie's voice. Anyone else? She just seems like a really nice girl. I'd love to be friends with her. Okay, here's our food. Uh, it looks kind of questionable. We got some sushi and some ramen. Oh! Oh! No, Olivia! Oh, it's gone. I just got a text, but I was not letting you see what it says. Anyway, I just had a stroke. Anyway, I'm gonna eat our food, and then I'm gonna tidy the apartment, and then I'm gonna shoot in the morning when I got my life together, because I, I I don't even want you to see me at the minute. I'm just a mess. I'm all over the place. Rise and shine. Last night, I basically stayed up for ages until like three, which meant I'd been up for like 24 hours. I woke up at like 12. I'm very naughty, I am, you know me. And I got myself a wee Starbucks. And now I think we're gonna go to Westfields. I literally have no idea where I am, like literally where am I? Also, I had a shit this morning and this was the view. Like, what is my life? Let me see if my outfit's ugly. I haven't shaved my armpits in like two days, so I'm gonna have to do that. What do you think? Also, this is a makeup desk that I actually do need to build myself, but like as if I'm gonna be fucking building that myself, there's no, no chance in hell. It would end in tears. But yeah, that's all I have to say for now. I'm just gonna like make this a few day vlog. I think we're gonna meet up with the Lewis tomorrow, the light of my life. I'm just gonna vlog him for the full day because he is the most entertaining person I've ever met. Doesn't Flossie look good? Hi! I my teeth are all fuzzy because I haven't brushed them in so long. Oh. Just at Westfield and I got this sweet uh, tofu battle bun. I'll give you a closer look. It's a tofu battle bun? I just mean she didn't come to play, do you know what I mean? She's here, she's large and she's in charge. Don't my arms look really long when I do that? What? Oh no, I'm just speaking to myself. Oh, sorry. 
It's okay. I got loads of stuff for my room, but I'm not showing it because the whole separate video. This is just a vlog. This is just you enjoying my life. It truly is spectacular. You could probably work out where I live from that, but I don't really care. Like, literally, come find me. Like, you can come stand outside my window and watch me take a shit if you want because half the fucking London are watching me take a shit anyway. Apart from my bedroom stuff, I got two tops from Evernight Fitters. Do you want to see them? Okay, I'll show you them. That, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> oh my god, I got a spit bubble in my throat. We are feeling it. <gasps> oh, yes. A vision. Oh, Olivia. Did you know Flossie's middle name is Bitches? It's not Bitches. It's Beatrice. Because I am a Tory. Joking. I'm <laughs> not a Tory. I'm not a Tory. That I'm not a Tory. <laughs> Yeah. You know what? I was gonna, I was gonna tie it all up, but I'm not bothered. So let's just show it like this. Oh, cute! Do I? Oh my god! Um, and then the back is like backless, but you just tie it. Um. It's rude to be that tanned. Stop! I'm peeling. I'm peeling so badly. Show them my legs. Oh. <laughs> That is pale, like what the fuck? <laughs> it's so upsetting to me. That is really upsetting. I know. More, <laughs> more. Did you just lick it? <laughs> All right, love's going out for drinks now. I'll show you what I'm wearing, fine. You know me, as soon as I get something new, I have to put it on, so I've got the yellow top on. Why don't I just grab my boob? What boob? I know you were thinking it. I just said it. Then I, I'm borrowing this jacket off Flossie. It's really cute, isn't it? This is me. This is real. This is me. I'm exactly where I'm supposed to be now. Your little light shine on me. That was really good. I should become a professional country singer. Let's go, guys. Bitch, sit on my face, yeah, tap that. E.T. E.T., I love you. It's open. <laughs> Do something funny. Oh my god, it wasn't funny. <laughs> I know, I didn't vlog. Or dinner, but we got Wagamama. We're just gonna have to take oh, my word for it. I get the Kare Barroso ramen. It's. Mm. I'm sorry. I feel like energized after that meal. <laughs> Don't be sorry. No, I just, I just. Oh, wait, oh, wait. Lewis's name, baby, was a girl. <laughs> Jillian. I'm not a Jillian. Oh, I'm like a Megan with an H. No, no you're a Jillian, a love. <laughs> Don't flatter yourself. Uh, Did you know yeah. Flossie's middle name is Bitches? It's not. It's Beatrice. Mm. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. They call me Latifa. What the? <laughs> no, I want to tell you something. I don't know exactly what he's saying. <laughs> <laughs> um, child. Anyway, so we did end up getting very drunk last night. You know me. I'm feeling a little bit worse for wear this morning. I got this Starbucks like peach green tea lemonade, and it's kind of reviving me a wee bit. I'm in. Pain. We're literally going to do like a little work two hours. I want to die. I'm a bit confused because Lewis is wearing like the exact same clothing as the day before, but that is because he did in fact keep on that clothing for I'd say a good twenty four hours, give or take. So just keeping in the lip, just exposing Lewis. You know me. Hey, girls, sixty second put, and they're like, <laughs> and she's like, and sit in the saddle, and they're like. <laughs> And she's like, good girl, and girls, like, take a minute, get some water, and they're like, and they're like okay, now we're getting the dumbbells up, and then it's like, push it, push it. Okay, right, we're off the soles like a night. So we thought we would practice a little bit. Okay, girls, and out the saddle. And breathe. Keep breathing. And on the count of five, go down to the handlebars and back up. Five. Get it all night. Get it all day. Hey, we want that hole. Hey, we want that big booty. Olivia, the fans want to know. <laughs> Olivia, you've just moved to London. The fans want to know how's the move going. Yeah, it's good, but have a good one. And we've seen recently <laughs> that she's breaking up. How's the move to London gone with that? <laughs> yeah, I <don't> know. <laughs> and the speculation with you and Ben Morris. <laughs> 
<laughs> Olivia, I love what you've done with the place. It looks beautiful. Uh, hey, Louis! The fans want to know. I've been, I've been looking for you everywhere. Uh, yeah. So, like, uh, everyone's away in Greece. Why are you not there? Um, honestly, <laughs> I love the girls so much out there, but sometimes you just need space. There's no beef. So, so you're not going to get on any internet beef with them? No, honestly, I'm all about love right now. I'm just working on some <laughs> Exciting secret project. Drops his Louis Vuitton. <laughs> working on some super exciting secret project for you. I can't wait to see them. Okay, well it's been oh it's been amazing speaking to you. Flossy. So Flossy, I heard speculations about you being on the celebrity Tinder. <laughs> We've heard speculation with you and Ben Morris. Is there any truth to this rumor? <laughs> London makes your skin terrible. Don't come here. Don't what believe the rumours. <laughs> Don't believe the rumours, darling. Look Poops at that. in the pudding. Look at that glow on it. Okay, so we finished Soul Cycle now. It was a wee bit horrendous. I I was expecting some like chill, little fun exercise class. Like, oh my god, no. Yeah, it was intense and I wasn't very good at it because I'm not used to like going on spin mics. Like I never go to spin mics. So I was like struggling so much. I was struggling the most in the whole class. I don't think, I think you did a really good you job. Slayed. Don't downplay it. You really slayed. You killed it, baby girl. Um, Honestly. She just looked like she was pitying me the whole time. You're giving me uh, Gigi Hadid vibes. On the oh! <laughs> my posture was so bad. This is me on the mic. It's the hunchback for me. <laughs> good morning, London. <laughs> Good morning, Snapchat. I'm ending the vlog here. It's been so much fun moving <laughs> in, and I will see you in my next video. You were that good to buy TV Why now. do you, every time I speak, you should speak over me? It's <laughs> ADHD. Attention. Do you yeah, actually have ADHD? ADHD. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I have it. I got di I'm not medically diagnosed, but I got diagnosed by my school nurse. <laughs> she, was, she was like, you have it. And then I was like, my parents probably take me to go get tested because they don't believe it's real. She was like, you have it. I'm leaving. <laughs> We're going to go buy a TV and watch Midsummer tonight and eat some... Midsummer's a night's dream. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't even funny. 